Hey folks, welcome back to Let's Play Shogo. Now it's time to rescue that cat. Get hyped, get pumped. <laughs> I don't think that I'll spoil very much when I say that uh, the next section is going to be the peak of silly that this game will reach. Or that any game should ever reach. <laughs> Don't ask. Well, you told her not to ask. As a tidbit, um, this water will kill you. While I'm not 100% sure, I want to say that it's the only water in the game that does so, for whatever reason. You better believe that everybody in here is hostile. <laughs> there are no innocents in here. See your shadow through the wall. So, uh, you might have already uh, heard the cat meowing in the background. Um, while you might think that it's a good idea to follow the sound till it gets louder, it's, it's really not. Um, the layout of the level is uh, pretty confusing and you can get lost very, very easily. So, uh, just bear with me for the moment. I'm not getting lost, uh, but uh, I'm actually going in the wrong direction for the moment. I just want to clear out this area for later. It will become the right direction eventually, if that makes sense. <laughs> okay, with that area cleared out, let's uh, actually take the right way. Yes, I hear you. Fucking cat. The noise can get really annoying over time. Oh shit, oh shit, shit, shit. No, 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 let's get out. No. Oh, ah. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, I fell victim to a new weapon here, actually. I'm going to get my hands on it real soon and we'll have some sweet revenge on those jackasses. This is the energy grenade launcher, and unlike the Kato grenade launcher, it's actually a good weapon. Somebody's coming! Protect the toy! And here we have the first objective for this level, the squeaky toy. But you have to wait a second before I pick it up. Always get your pickups. Eat your pickups, people. Yep, there it is. You ready? Let's get it. <laughs> ah, this is so dumb. <laughs> okay, um, this is a Captain Claw doll. Uh, Captain Claw is a 2D platformer also made by Monolith. Roughly released at the same time. And if you like silly platformer games with a pirate cat, then check it out! <laughs> so, I'm uh, sure you want to know what this doll actually does. Are you ready? Strap in. Here goes. Yep, that's all. <laughs> it's just a dumb thing. <laughs> And for some reason I have the hardest time making this jump. It must be something about the surface, I'm sure. So, as I've told you, this level is kind of confusing and um, you can get stuck inside because the way is not very uh, intuitive. You actually have to go around here and then break through the glass because the doors on the inside are locked. Living dangerously. Find your own dinner. 
sick bastards. No, no, Sanjuro. Eating cats is perfectly acceptable in many parts of this world. And there she is. Don't worry, you will get a better look at her. Just in a moment. And you might saw this coming. Sorry, no time for pussy. Oh, monolith, you cheeky guys. What? Did you see that? Wait a minute. Yep, sure happens. <laughs> Here, kitty, kitty. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Come here, you stupid cat. Should I even ask? Just ran into some stragglers that were trying to eat a cat. Can you say that again slowly? Pervert. I'm having trouble picturing it. Maybe you could demonstrate. Maybe. You must have amnesia. Well. <laughs> that sure was the thing. Cat get. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, but I, I'm really out of words at this point. I'm just overwhelmed by the silliness of this whole section. The most embarrassing moment in my entire life, and no one to share it with. Worries about her widow poop and you Thanks, mister. Give me a sec. I'll turn off the electricity. Thanks a lot, lady. You want me to take the garbage out for you? You're crazy. I seriously got nothing at this point. This whole section was just beyond anything. <laughs> Sanjuro! What's happening? The CNC, they're all over the place. Listen to me. Toshiro is Gabriel, but there's more to it than that. Kofinyo... Kura! Bye. Seems like Kura is in trouble. And what did she say? Toshiro is Gabriel? <gasps> what a twist! <laughs> Uh, you remember Toshiro, um, the brother of Sanjuro, who was also supposed to be dead? Uh, seems like he's the bad guy after all. But Kuro also mentioned another name, Kothaniel. And we have never heard that. Or did we? And where's Hank in all of this? Kura! What's going on, Sanjuro? Where's Kura? I don't know, bro. This is a very empty club, I have to say. I know you, you're from Shogo, Ryo Ishikawa. They're taking her to their main security offices in Upper Maritropa. Yeah, I can help you get inside, but you've got to do me a favor first. What's the catch? Head back to your MCA. I'll be in touch soon. If them fallen freak boys find she's been captured, she could be in big trouble. You gotta get there before they do. What have you done, Sanjuro? If she comes to harm, I swear I will kill you with my own hands. Oh, now you're a loving father suddenly, huh? Well, we've met a new character, Ryu Ishikawa. Um, he is the head of Shogo, the company, and while we do not know anything more about him at this point, I think it's safe to say that he's a shady guy. It's also worth to point out this item, for reasons that will be obvious in a, in a bit. For now I have to uh, spread some blood on the dance floor, create some panic at the disco. <laughs> Oh man, okay that was that was bad. <laughs> I had a reason for going all out here. Damn rocket launchers. No pass, no ticket. 
Yeah, right here. I'm sorry, sir, but that pass isn't validated. You need to get it validated. Where? Any of the shops in Crescent Square can do it for you. Check at the register. So here's the thing, um, no shops are open and if you come here without the pass, he's telling you that you need the pass. But in fact, you don't need it at all, you can just walk by. And? <laughs> Whoops, <laughs> I didn't want to crit you, buddy. <laughs> uh, if you damage him, he's going to open that back door and come out. Uh, what I'm saying is that I'm pretty sure that they had something planned for this point. What kind of clown car bullshit is this? Oh, the ragdolls are great sometimes. And so we get kicked into the next mech section, and it's worth pointing out that mech combat will get harder from here on out, because we will see new types of enemy mechs. You didn't think we were done with Samantha, did you? No, not by a long shot. This is another section where you can get stuck because it's not very obvious what you have to do here. Actually, this is one of the very few instances where your mission log will help you. It's hard to see, but there are foot soldiers up on those roofs. And I'm not giving any fuck. Man, that was satisfying. Damn it! <laughs> Too short. <laughs> Okay, look for Canopy Station and dock your MCA. You can catch a tram to Upper Maritropa. Don't be late this time. I'm doing my best, Hank. I'm doing my best. So, welcome to one of the longest and uh, most difficult mech sections of the game. You better strap yourself in because this is going to get loud and hard. Here you can uh, get a good look at the new difficulty. I mean, just look at me unloading onto this guys. And he's still up. <laughs> Seriously, how did he survive all this? Yep, I see you there, I see you there. You know what? Fuck that. Fuck it. Let's go all out. Whoops. <laughs> 
That was a shameful mistake. <laughs> uh, I zigged when I should have zagged. The CMC will put up energy grids to hinder your progress. But that's no problem for us. We will just slaughter our way to the city. You know how FPS players never look up? It's a bitch when developers take that into account. There's actually progress in that direction, but I want to get some more uh, combat out of this section. Look how long it takes me to kill this guy with the rifle. Yeah, way, way too long. Weapons that don't cause explosions are getting really worthless at this point. Or better should say, they are getting worthless against the mech enemies. I don't want to bore you with uh, using the same explosive weapons all the time. But on the other hand, I don't want to die <laughs> to all the enemies. Oh, you cheeky asshole! Yeah, just look at this. It takes way too long. Explosions are just a better choice at this point. I don't know how to phrase it any other, other way. There's a reason why I'm twitchy and I'm scanning up there. <laughs> oh, you will see. Yep, bullshit, bullshit. But despite the occasional dick moves, I really like this section. Because you're in a big mech and you're wrecking shit constantly. <laughs> I feel that the game should have uh, should have had more sections like this. In the end I think the foot sections are a bit too dominant and uh, mech combat really should have been a strong point. It's often a good idea to uh, remove wreckage so that it will not explode in your face. And here we come up on a new enemy and it's actually the strongest mech enemy. 
Yep, one shot. And I'm dead. <laughs> uh, those are real dicks. They will all have late game weapons and can take a good amount of damage. Like five hits from the Juggernaut. They are not too, too common. But when you see them, you better go all out. Here I'm trying uh, to see how the snipe mode fares against them. Not that great. And for some reason I'm going all crazy here. I really don't know what got into me at this point. I think uh, I thought that there was an enemy hiding up there and I was paranoid that he killed me. <laughs> I was so paranoid that I almost killed myself. <laughs> uh, don't mind me. I get it back on track in a second. If we talk about the track, um, this level is also really unintuitive and it's very easy to get lost because it's very large and uh, the, a lot of the areas look the same. This actually happened to me, as you can see here. <laughs> I'm also checking my mission log. It took me a while to figure out where to go. I'm at the station. And this is the point where I'm going to sign off. Uh, the video will actually continue because it will end on a cutscene, so don't stop watching. Bye bye. Hank, what's Cothineal? Oh, Cothineal is the reason the Fallen exists. But Kura can explain everything. You shouldn't have any trouble. I've guaranteed that CMC security has its hands full elsewhere. I'll contact you once you're inside. I've heard about you, Rio. You're not a man to be trusted. The press bends the truth to suit its own agenda. You should know that better than anyone. Leave it at that. Rio out. You. It's so romantic. Wow, I don't know about that. What's that supposed to mean? Rio Ishikawa contacted me. From Shogo? Yeah, he's using me for something. Not quite sure what it is yet, but I'll figure it out. Well, be careful. Oh, Sanjuro? Yeah? I just wanted to apologize for how I reacted when I heard Kuro was alive. I love my sister as much as you do. I'm just... It's okay. I understand.